Didn't see you there. You caught us playing treasure hunt. Count by fours. We're playing this on these cards, but you can use you can make your own cards with index cards, which is very cool. And we are playing count by fours, but when you make them yourself, you can count by ones, count by fractions, count by whatever your needs are. You can also go backwards, but right now we're going forwards, and we'll show you how that looks. All right, so each row starts with a colored circle and also 10 cards going all the way down. It goes from four all the way to 40. So your first step is to pick a card, and I got a green eight. So what you're gonna do with this card is you are going to go to the colored dot and you're gonna count all the way to that number and then you're gonna flip it up and pass it on to the next person. So I have an eight, so I'm gonna go four, eight, and I'm gonna switch these around, keep it face up, and I got a green 20. So I'm gonna give that to Maya in order to count all the way down. And so now I'm gonna go four, eight, 12, 16, 20. And I'm gonna take this card and I'm gonna like flip it up just like that and then give the next card to Haley. Oh, look, we got an orange 12 over here. So I'm gonna go four, eight, 12, and I'm gonna flip it up and she got a 32. <laughs> and so now, the whole point of the game is to keep doing this until you find a treasure. The whole point is that once you find a treasure, you're gonna keep your treasure and whoever has the most treasures wins. So if we keep going, um, we have four, eight, 12, 16, 20, 24, 28, 32. Now I'm gonna flip this up, flip this up. Oh, and look at that. A, I treasure. Found a treasure. So now I keep this, and Haley will now pick her own card and then start from the beginning again. Whoever has the most treasures win. It's really fun. Now, let's say we wanted to switch it up. We're gonna, We're take, gonna take, take colors. our colors all the way over there. And now and we now count backwards. So we go we start from here and we count backwards this way. This is how it would look. So since I have a 20, a blue 28, I'm gonna look at the blue over here and I'm gonna go. 40, 36, 32, and then 28. And Maya got another 28, and so she's gonna have that orange. So then you would just keep counting backwards, and that's how you would play the game backwards. And yet again, whoever gets the most treasures wins. And so the whole point is that it's very modifiable. You can play it with different numbers. You can play it starting like at a, like 11 to 20, or depending on whatever thing you wanna work with forward or backwards. Um, and that is how you play Treasure Hunt, count by fours.